As you research, it is important for you to be able to distinguish between different types of sources and to recognize when certain sources are appropriate and credible. When you search, consider questions such as, what type of information do I need? What kinds of sources contain the information that I need? How can I be sure that the information I have found is credible? First, think about the type of information that you need. Each type of source, such as a newspaper article, a scholarly journal article, a blog post, an organizational website, a government website, or even a YouTube video, has different characteristics, was created for different purposes, and can be used in different ways. Certain types of sources may be more appropriate for specific contexts than others. In some cases, you may be required to use scholarly sources, such as articles published in academic journals. In other cases, it may be acceptable to use popular sources, such as magazine articles or news websites. If you are not sure, you should always check with your instructor to determine which types of sources you are expected to use. When deciding which sources to use, it is also important that you consider the credibility of the source. There are several different things to look for. First, you will want to consider the authority of the source. Who created this source? Was it an individual? An organization? What are the credentials of the author? Was it written by a journalist or by a research scientist? Was it produced by a company or by the government? Learning as much as you can about the author of the source can go a long way to determining whether or not the source is credible. Next, think about how and why the source was created. What was the purpose and how does that impact the value of the information in the source? Is the source meant to entertain, to educate or inform, to persuade, to sell something? The purpose of the source can help you determine how credible that source might be. An article about energy efficient light bulbs can have a very different purpose depending on whether or not it was published in an academic journal or posted on the website of a company devoted to selling green products. You also want to consider the review process for the source. Prior to the source's publication, was it reviewed by anyone for accuracy? While some types of sources are reviewed by editors, fact checkers, or other scholars prior to publication, others are not, which can help to indicate which sources might be more credible. You also want to consider the currency of the source. In some cases, it is acceptable to use sources that are older, but in others, you need only the most up-to-date information. It is especially important that you carefully consider the credibility of sources that you find online, as there is no one to prevent people from posting inaccurate information. Many students have been taught to rely on the domain name, such as .edu or .org, to determine whether a website is credible. While this can be valuable information, you should not base your decision on the domain name alone. There can be very good information posted on .com websites and very poor information on .edu or .org websites. You need to evaluate the content of the site, not rely on the domain name. One type of source to be aware of is known as an advocacy website. This is the website of a group or organization that promotes a specific point of view or agenda. If you use such a source in your work, it's important that you acknowledge the perspective of the source as you use it. Learning how to identify appropriate and credible sources is a vital skill. Without carefully selecting your sources, you may end up including inappropriate or false information, which could negatively impact your grade. If you need help selecting sources, contact a librarian for assistance.